super fly in his three losses, but he is a technically solid. My left fighting out of the red uh, corner. Say that Carrillo win a title in Navarro. This is the third to 109 for him. And our question, oh, but that's uh, the southpaw Navarro as promised. Very solid jab. Always. And you know, the last time out, different kind of left hander. He's definitely better defense. Big difference, but uh, Perez did put Kirillov down with that. He's had his left if he can. So Kirillov, versatile Al. He could fight side again. As Kirillov was able to land the straight. I doubt that it'll land his hand of Kirillov. Excellent block from Navarro landed. So a good first round for the American. Yeah, Navarro having a very good first round. Just excellent box. Real off when he his man's got the superior hand speed. And Freddie's a calming in self motivated. Uh, that's the kind of guy. <laughs> Him, they really want that left hook, and that will force Kirillov to fights these super in that round. But Dimitri, those are exactly the kind of rounds at the end of it. It's hard as talking to a judge on these rounds. Into who won the first minute? Yep. The now the Russian audience wants Kirillov to step it up. He's very cautious. He's hesitant to the jab several times. So those of Dmitry Kirillov as sharp as he can be. Yeah, he worked too. He's landed to the body before. Here comes Kirillov with a head of steam. Hooks, uppercut, straight left hand in the case of uh, Kirillov. Not firing Kirillov. Kirillov. Navarro, Navarro on the left. The south. Perez, he uh, hit him with a double right hook. Perez. And for Kirillov, Navarro, and he needs to maybe try to short offense. Yeah, a lot of holding here. These are two very, very, he's got that right-hand guard up when he's out of his face. Key to this foot of Navarro. That's why those upper... And should uh, Kirillov be moving low, that right hand. That's a knockdown. Actually instructing, yep. don't hit, though. That's a must -done. Stunned a little and not... Now, Navarro, you can tell, he wants to come back strong yeah, to he show does. he wasn't hurt. Advice, we elect not United States. Back to the screen. He's on the left, the southpaw early in the fight but put Navarro on the floor in this round right hand against Perez it landed often in a round that Navarro otherwise really dominated and look he just barely touched the glove now part of that problem is Sam Bevere you went he has himself to blame for that he didn't get in between those fighters quickly enough and Kirillov landed some more punches here we see there's the right hand now he goes down now, of course, he's trying to get him out. The rest of the round was controlled. Knocked out already. I think the other drama, Al, is how does Navarro respond? But, you know, where's his... Kirillov has landed big right hand. The other way, right? So it's a matter of... Uh, and don't square himself. Hit with the... Uh, look, he's uh, hit with those right hands. 16, 20-inch punch. There. Kirillov can get that punch in against... His right hands for Kirillov. Line. Great division. Of course, with the title on the line. Nice left hand. Drives Kirillov back, makes him restart, but Kirillov trying to press forward here. Look, he's nobody punching. Kirillov or Navarro's. The right hand. And that was a double right hand by Kirillov. Almost nobody just does it. And there again, he split. In the last minute of the round, Jose Navarro did very well, and that straight left hand was part. Big left hand, but certainly a strategic fight. Each guy. Trying to move the guy that was in. And there are two good straight lefts by Navarro. And he Kirillov with that. Yeah, he's putting his punches together now. And uh, Kirillov, Torres, uh, uh, on the home with it. And now warned um, uh, Kirillov about. So. And if it was, and it would go to the scorecards at this jump. It's been down that 10 8 the case. Kirillov, nice right hand, not able to put hand speed out of him. He's had a run as well, but Navarro has been a little sharper in this round. Very good round here. Inside. Interesting and at times exciting. The world contenders fighting for a title for good reason. Young men who are skilled and both deserve to be an opponent from oh, here on. Absolutely in. not. Too much ability here. I seems to be bothering him. For Jose Navarro for the most part. Clash of heads and we believe it was so noted. Check us out. And a couple of points to me. And win these exchanges. Navarro standing in. Uh, if they want the counter right out of uh, Navarro, they feel that. Uh, One punch has not emerged in this fight, and it's not Navarro. He just hasn't been able to be spread was against uh, Kirillov. Yeah, uh, there he got the momentum back, Al. You're right. The body, that close fight. Well, how did you have the knockdown round? I made a 10 8, but, but uh, I had the first two. That left hand. They should Navarro trying to poke that left low at times. 
there when he fired. In this round, his straight right again is becoming a major factor. Um, Sultan Abragamov defends his double history. Good combination from Kirillov. And he followed over the corner again. It is a match that has had ebb and flow. It has great fighters in it, like Christian Maharas, who might be just a lot of good fighters in this division that can make great matchups like this one. Yeah, right hand from Kirillov, and that... But Navarro didn't take the play there. He started the thing in that uh, left hand. It'd be dangerous, but he's got to up the offensive output, Navarro, because real off. Sit here and watch this fight. There's another right hand by... And yeah, the little bit of power, and I think speed as well, Al. I think it's those two components. Who gets the edge in that? These exchanges are just so key. And both men getting a lot of work by Kirillov with his left hook. Men are landing by Navarro, which... Um, a minute early, we hope not. But, um, <laughs> Navarro's a little more active. It's a close round, huh? Yeah. Reel off that right hand, a little short right hand, didn't land there, but he's again doing a good job. There's that thing left that way. But I'd like to see a little fake to the faint to the left and uh, get the closer round as your luck profile. Everybody will be different. Trying the younger guy here. Well, you know, I think Krilov is probably overall. Um, He's never really knocked him down and stunned him momentarily. That's why you want to see the little guys fight. They fight with a lot of courage and guts. But they're off at 29 and Navarro at 20. In your 30s, effectively, when you're throwing so many shots. Oh, hell. And Very good punch and strong. Oh, there's a little left hand from Navarro. But look at the left hand low by Kirillov. Dangerous. Now we'll go into a flurry here, but he's still up. Jose Navarro's landing some. The right hook has not been it, there for him. Because... Now. That's probably the difference. And he's keeping his left hand up. A minute of a fight, and we'll see it uh, offensively. Shoulder, shoulder injuries. He's had two shoulder surgeries and says it helped back. Yeah, yeah on the way they want to move, actually. Well, that right hand, uh, Navarro moving away from it. Right it it's simple. It's Kirillov's turn. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know, now it's Kirillov's turn to have a good round. That's okay. the way. A rare body shot by below the eye, so it's but he could lose it on the scorecards. But he's up. Well, you're starting to get the feeling just for, he's not can't walk through Navarro, but he came out with conviction. He, I thought Grilov last week he may feel like there was concern about left hand now down the middle with the left. To really pull the trigger, no, a little missing a bit. It's not as noticeable, but it's there nonetheless. On the eyebrow of Navarro. Can't feel good. We got a title on the line in part of this round. Right. I was getting the feeling that the third close round. What else is new? <laughs> Landing good counter right hand, lunging a little bit, and now there's the defense of Kirillov slipping as uh, Navarro missed. I don't know if Navarro's missed five straight punches in this fight, so that was a good defense by Kirillov. Then again, the counter, and there's. Uh, Again, the countering work by Dmitry Kirillov. And, uh, so Navarro, who had a few good moments. But uh, Kirillov had only 10 knockouts in his 31 fights. You know, one clash of heads caused that headbutt on both sides. Yeah. Navarro has been down, so uh, we both thought uh, very impressive. A lot of rounds on your card, Al. A nice left hook by, uh, I mean, in a long time. Three-minute chunks. So you give uh, the first minute to somebody, the second maybe to somebody else, and then conclude. Took by... And I think could get some of the job done. Looks mm -hmm. uh, right. You're right. Both men get another lefty, and the advantage dissipated a little bit now by Krilov's good work. Absolutely. Not. There's that straight left hand up the middle for Navarro, trying to solve the puzzle. He's inside, not doing anything, feigning his way. There's the knee of Navarro. Again, I feel that hook could be the effective punch. Good straight right hand from Krilov as he starts to. Well, Navarro back. It didn't discourage at all. You have to look at this fight. This is the kind of stuff. I mean, technically, these guys are so sound, Al. Kriloff early in that round with that left hook the course of this. That one actually looked like it staggered. But saying, you know, you got to take more back. The uh, super flyweight, uh, or the IBF in Moscow. Blue. From the United States, Jose Navarro. Big punchers. Probably, they might not knock, get knocked out either of them. Been on the deck in the third. Judges, two from the United States, one from Rodrigo. Yeah, Kirillov short. And Navarro trying to create a little bit of distance. 
Ruff is the slightly harder puncher. There's that hand, right hand, ready to unload. Oh. Big hooks and right. Yeah, the hooks and right. that. There's the right. Now Navarro could be hurt. No, he's coming out winging, trying to back up and by that flurry. And here Kirillov, now the power seems to be taking over as he starts to drive Navarro into his own. Minute to go, and Kirillov really turning on the Jets here in Moscow. And Nick, you called it. It's the left hook. Big round for Any chance it could be a 10-8 without the Well, ball. it could be. A judge could score it that yeah, way. He's ooh. dominated it. Follow up right from Kirillov. Now he wants to close out the 11th. It's hard to never really a moment of, uh, I would call it, big right hands. And it was just Kirillov to unload. That. Plus, it's absolutely a paper thin lead. Uh, well, and Kirillov. And it could be. I have Kirillov ahead by two points in this fight. It's conceivable somebody could have it closer. However, you're right. If if Navarro needs in his spots, and Navarro's allowing got to be somewhat exhausting here for 12 rounds. There's a combination. Some land, some don't. But and for the first time, stunning Navarro. And there again, really let it all go. And here comes rapid fire combination as Kirilla hangs in there, takes shots to taking here tonight in Moscow. The American trying to open loses tonight. But what they are, a top contender in this division. Nice right hand for the Super Flyweight Championship. 12th round, really. I would give it to him. The right hand. Yeah, he throws the hook and the...